What's going on guys? Welcome back to part 7 of Quantum Break. Last episode, Jack was going through some of Will's old stuff and managed to find a key that had Bradbury swimming pool on there and we went there with Beth Wilder that you can see in the background there. And we went to the Bradbury swimming pool and we're still investigating to see what is there. If you guys do go on to enjoy this video, make sure you hit that like button. And if you're new, make sure you subscribe. I've also done a couple of FIFA videos. If you're interested in FIFA, I'll leave a link to them down below. So act two, part three, Bradbury swimming pool. Let's go. All right, so Will's been pretty busy over the years and he's built a second time machine. So we've got to use the time machine to travel back in time. Undo everything in the past before it happens. Let's see what this is. Nobody dies. Paul doesn't go through. It says the time machine core needs to be reset. Reset core. What the hell's it look Alright, do I just do a little... Alright. So, we gotta go down here. So, reset the core. So, Jack's gone from not knowing what the hell he's doing to... knowing exactly what he's doing. Like, I don't understand what's happening. How does he know what he's doing? Alright, what's this? Warning, core not activated. Alright. Hey. It looks like I can reset the core from here. No clue. But I, I did help Paul set up the machine at the university. Which then caused the fracture. Look, Will knew the calculations were wrong. I'm hoping that means he knew what he was doing here. This is what Will said he to. We have to test it. Oh, turn it up! How does he know what he's doing? Alright, so that's loading. But how does, how does the man know? How does Jack know what he's doing? Honestly, he just pressed a couple of buttons on the keyboard, and now he knows what he's doing. He's just turned into a super genius, apparently. Or oh, it's over here. All right, so we got some things that are highlighted over here. All right, we've got a computer screen. What's this? A folder. Will Joyce, where are you? To Beth Wilder. Time has arrived. It's here. All right. We've got a diagram here. Some sort of module there. Uh, more things on boards here that we can read. Just plans of the time machine there. All right. All right, what have we got here? The corridor, it's key activated. Oh, so that's what your key's for. Wait, warning, core not activated. Looks like I have to do something else Oh, hang on. Come on, there's more shit on the board here. What's this, more diagrams right. of the time machine? Time machine room map. Will received a massive Report. research grant in 1997. He'd successfully built the time machine by 1999. Right. But the results scared him. Let's see what... Alright, so we've got to turn this on. Hey, it's you. Piss off. Alright, core activation ready. Here goes nothing. Oh, it's alright. I can handle this. I'm good at this bit. This is the only thing I can do. Here we go. Easy does it. And we're almost there. We, he milks it. There we go. We're there. It's all right. Amy, shut up. I know what I'm doing. You shouldn't even be here. All right, so now the core's activated. So I assume I need to get three green lights. Okay. We activate. Now, do, can I do this? Date input. I can't insert the date. Corridor not active. Fail date. Activate the core. Activate the corridor. All right. Well, what's behind here? Is this more stuff no, I can read? Nothing I can make sense of. All right. A civilian's guide to time travel. Machine overview. Just some notes there. All right. It's just more stuff around here. All right. So we'll run around. Is there anything here? There's a light blinking. All right, Beth. All right, I'm just just exploring. My time vision eyes going off. There's got to be some. All right, so I think there is something around here. Yes, there is. Is that a skill point? Beautiful. Thank you. Four or five chronon right. sources found. All right. Upgrade point available. What's this? Parents killed in Riverport car crash article. All right, so I've got to go to this computer now and see if the key works this time. I think it's supposed to do that. Yeah. Yeah, of course. All right. to a time machine and he left it in a trunk of his Sweet. <laughs> That's 
with my brother in the hat shop. <laughs> Why would he keep the fucking key in his car? Retard. Is a beach ball? Oh! Fuck. Let's just hope. I'm gonna beach ball. Oh, all right, all right. Activate the. All right, so set the date. All right. Go to this computer, do we? All right. No, 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 no. What? God damn it. I don't know. We were so close. I'm gonna try it again. Yeah, like hell you are. You saw what happened. Something's wrong with the machine. But we don't know that. You're not trained for this. Anything you do is gonna make it worse. We you can't know I'm right. Stop trying. You lost people. You're angry. I get it. But this is bigger than us. We can't fix the machine. But I might know somebody who can. Sophia Amaral. The monarch scientist. I saw her video near Ground Zero. Serene's head of Cronin Research. She'll be at the Monarch Gala tonight, but security's airtight. She'll be nearly impossible to get to. Unless I have an invite. Paul told me he expected me to meet him at that party. Something tells me that was not a friendly invitation. Jack, no. All right, so end of act two there. That was quite short, that bit. Can we continue now? The future used to be so clear when I was reliving the past. Once I caught up to the moment I had left, that ended. All I've had to go on since then are the plan and the visions. I knew Jack would come to me. I'd seen that, but I didn't know why exactly or how it would end. There he is. You were right. My visions of the future aren't always clear, but they don't lie. Speaking of lies, Joyce is saying he's discovered his brother's time machine. We've spent 17 years looking for it, and he finds it in less than a day? Does sound unlikely. Still, we know it's out there somewhere, and we don't know what his brother managed to tell him. If he really has located the machine, why would he come here and tell you? Smart Money says he's trying to play you. Maybe, but the machine is out there. It's in our interest to find out where. If Jack knows, I have to talk to him. Dr. Joyce could have provided the answer All to that right, question. Junction to well, personal slash business, Paul Serene. How's my man's crib, though? Every young man going to cooperate any more than his brother. Oh, hang on, what's on this computer? I've seen it. You remember Jack as a close friend, but that clouds your judgment. What's on? Look at this man's house. It's not. Just an email there, all right. So we're gonna try and follow Hatch. I know what's at stake here, hey. Warren. Paul Serene is living the good life. This crib, my man's house. Uh, Bowman Hatch. Well, let's stop everything. Oh, hang on. Oh, so there's Jack down there, alright. Uh, anything down there? Mr. Joyce is waiting for us down below. Yeah, alright, alright. I'm just having a look at my own what house, okay? Here? I'm Should basking in how good it is. It's all on schedule. You're micromanaging. Oh! He's got a Lambo! Don't even twitch. Alright. Last time we were Paul Serena, I had to make a decision, so I feel like I'm going to have to do it again. Oh, I think so. To see the Look at all the cards. Sick and traitorous up close and personal. What's up, bitch? And it was such a nice invitation. How do you want to deal with this, Paul? Oh, here we go. I could still try to reach Jack and make him see reason. Or I could let Hatch deal with him so nothing would distract me from leading Monarch. 
All right, so LT hold to show personal or RT hold to show business, all right? I've been to the past. I've tried to change things. Answer me this quick, Mom. I once trusted Jack more than anybody. It was my only chance to make him understand the truth. The fuck do you mean nobody got a look at the shooter? But without me there to give the speech, my empire would start to crumble like a house of cards. Serene chooses to focus on his relationship with Jack and let Monarch fend for itself for a while. Hope to show business. I believe that with hope comes miscalculation. And as you and I are well aware, Mr. Torts, with miscalculation can often come a catastrophe. And that leaves me with you, Mr. Torts. But my old friend would be a lost cause, dead and buried along with the rest of my past. Tonight is a celebration, a celebration in face of darkness. Tonight we celebrate because I promise to you that we are prepared. Monarch would grow stronger with my presence. The plan would go forward as intended. Serene chooses to focus on leading Monarch rather than wasting time on Jack. All right, so hold to show personal, hold to show business. Serene, all right, so Paul's had a lot of chances that he could have actually killed Jack. So I feel that he still respects Jack. So I feel personal is probably the option to choose between these two. As I said, like we had that part last episode where he could have ordered the guard to shoot and he ordered him not to. So I feel Paul would choose the personal choice, I think. All right, I'm gonna just do it. Confirm choice, here we go. Martin, I'm afraid you're gonna to have to cover for me at the speech tonight. All right. Jack and I have a lot of catching up to do. Yeah. leads I've been to the end of time and I've escaped it all the way to 1999 when it all started I've tried to change things but by trying I only made them happen in the first place security was tight at the monarch gala you took quite a risk walking into the lion's den. If we were going to kidnap Dr. Amaral, then we needed to do it from the inside. Beth Wilder. You were quick to trust her. We had common interests. Is that all you had? That's all we needed. Well, I'm starting to think seeing a pretty lady like you is too much to hope for. Why don't you keep your mouth shut while we get some privacy before we begin? How about you get me out of this chair? Ah, uh, uh, uh. stop squirming. And you're gonna need this. Sure. What's it look like out there? Okay, Act Three, I Part One, her. Research Everyone's Facility. We're back with Jack Joyce. Now we're gonna follow so Beth. All right, let's continue. Working. And Dr. Emerald. I don't have a fix on her. She's either at the party or at her office at the R&D facility here on the island. I'll scout out the party. Can't go in so that you're door. gonna sip champagne while I break into a high security installation. It's like you got this all figured out. I'll save you a cocktail, Weenie. Oh, well, in that case. 
My cover is open the door, bitch. Enough. Hurry up. It'll last a little longer, so you can't walk out the front door with me. This is the quickest way to the R&D facility. I disabled the security at the back door, but there'll be guards. Contact me when you're clear. Well, thanks for that. that that'll help. Just, can you open this and door? Jack, you know what's at stake here. This can't be about revenge. Oh, it's... it's <laughs> you killed my brother. You can't say that. I'm not here for Paul. Yeah, bullshit. Alright. Escape the detention area. Wait, she's not coming. So you're just going to stand there, alright? Hey! He's escaping! Time rush. Hold LB to time rush. Keep holding LB to make this through the door. Melee takedown during the time rush. Press B to perform a melee takedown. I am Neo. That Thanks for the assault rifle. Alright. My powers are growing. So I've got time rush now, a new ability. Alright, hold our B to slow down time. Oh shit! Well that works well, didn't it? Who the hell designs these doors? Okay, I'm gonna have to move faster. I'll try again. Go! Indiana Jones style! Yes! That easy, alright. We go up here, I guess. Yes, I'm clear. What's next? Oh shit, what's that? Oh shit! Alright, let's say we use time rush for this bit. Oh! Use them bullets! Oh shit! Oh my god, it almost killed me. Alright, it's disabled now, alright. Oh no way! You can take the light machine gun off the turret, that is mad! Wait, I wanna get my shotgun. The shotgun's good. Alright. Okay. Bunker Hill. Well, where am I going? Oh, here we go. Uh, up you go. Wait, there's stuff over here. There we go. Another skill point, thank you. One of eight. Wait, can I upgrade? So now we've got time rush. So increase focus, hold focus time, triggered by aiming LT immediately after using time rush will last longer. Multi takedown, takedowns pressing B while near an enemy during time rush will drain less Krona energy. You know, I'm actually just going to upgrade it just because we got it. Alright, increase focus. There we go. Alright. And that's come down again. So I have to slow it down, do I? Or maybe I have to use my time rush and slow it down. Alright, so that and then go. Hold it. Shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! I've done this terrible. Hang on. Oh no. God damn it. Oh, I don't think that's how you're supposed to do Jack. it. Too slow, Jack. Shut up. You can't jump over bloody things that aren't even higher than your kneecap. Alright, here we go. Run. Yeah, there you, that's how you do it. Alright. My time vision. Oh, there's a couple of guys up here. Alright, so I want to try this new melee attack. So what do I do? Do I just run in? Reach the radar tower. Alright. Going in. But then smack him. Whoa! How's that? Shit! I'm facing the wrong way and a shotgun to the face! Oh my god! That was sick. Time felt broken here. Oh, alright, go on one side. Alright. So my time vision's pulsing. What what am I meant to do? cannon felt oh, here we go. in time. I'm focusing and I'm building cannon the the by just looking at it. Alright, now do I use my time? Rush again. Smart place to aim the cannon, guys. There we go, run right along the cannon. Oh, don't fall off it! Jesus. Alright. Reach the radar tower. Alright, Tom Vision, is there anything around here? You'll be frozen. Right. Yeah, I know. It's a risk. Alright, so we gotta take out these enemies. Alright, I'm just gonna run in. This is gonna be sick, right? Go! Oh my god! Shoot him in the face! Oh, he's dead. Oh, shit. Oh, God, there's turrets everywhere. All right, shield. I right, just hide. All right, these turrets. Oh, again. Oh, my God. Oh, I've just kicked him in the face. Oh, shit, I missed. I'm shooting the wrong thing. All right, put my shield up. Just sit in the bubble. All right, just chill out. All 
Alright, so there's a guy up there with a sniper rifle. Alright. Slow down time. Oh shit! So these guys have got sniper rifles, I'm just running around with my shotgun. Alright, stay down. Wait, and there we go! I'm gonna just destroy this sniper rifle, dude. If I can get there in time before it runs out. Oh shit! Oh, he's dead. Oh shit, there's a turret! Right, go down, go down, go down, go down, go down. Alright. Let's reload. Time vision. Alright, so there's three guys up there. Alright, pull out my pistol. Alright, slow down time. Run it through! Oh, this is so good. Boom! One hit KO, let's see. Alright, there we go. I'll just sit on my little shield, thank you. Oh, shit, shit, shit. Alright, oh, alright, slow down time. Shit! Don't die. Oh my god, my screen's red. Alright, just stay here, just chill out, just chill out. Alright, my shield up. There's a bit of ammo. I need to take out this turret. This is the thing that's pissing me off. All right, there's one guy to my left. I want the turret out first. All right, where is it? There it is. Run around it. Why did that? Oh my god! The turret's right behind you. What the hell? I did my little dash accidentally. All right, there we go. All right, now that's dead. Now let's take out these two last guys. Boom, one dead. And then, KO! Bang! Oh, he's dead, and then a 360 to finish it off. Oh, that was sick. All right, guys, we're going to leave it there for part 7 of Quantum Break. I just got this time rush ability. It's sick. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe. See you guys in the next video, part 8. Goodbye.